another video and in this video I'm going to show you how I get my high puff and I'm going to start off by spritzing my hair with some water and smooth that all in just to give my hair a little bit of softness and moisture and I'm going to take my Alakaj Naturals leave-in um, conditioner and also put that all over my hair and I'm doing my um, puff on an old twist out Okay, once I finish moisturizing my hair, I'm just taking a brush and I'm smoothing out my hairline and also the back of my hair. And it seemed like my hair was shrinking as I was making this video, so I'm pulling my hair a little tight just to stretch it out. And what I use to do my puff is a knee-high stocking, and I'm just going to place that in the back of my nape. Now once that's in the back of my nape, I'm going to tie my knee high and I'm going to start smoothing and pulling the knee high up. Once I get the knee high where I would want it, I'm going to start tightening the front and I place my thumb where I made the knot just so while I'm pulling my hair doesn't snag or get caught in between there. So once you get your puff where you want it, you're just going to pull a little tighter and make a knot in the back. Then all you got to do is fluff and pick just to give your hair some volume. And this is how I get my puff without any gel. But if you want a more smooth and sleeker look, you can apply gel and this is how I do it. I just apply gel all around my hairline and I top it off with my coconut oil just so my hair don't be hard and it also gives me a shiny finish. And of course you're going to follow up with the same steps as the beginning and smooth your hair out with your brush. And my hair was shrinking as I was doing the video, so I'm just going to pull my hair taut and tie it with a Auschwitz scrunchie. And I'm just going to take my silk scarf and tie my hair for about 30 minutes to let the gel set. my hair is all set the gel just give my hair a little bit more definition and shine and I'm gonna of course do the same steps with my knee-high stocking I'm gonna place it at my nape and I'm going to slide it all the way up to where I would want my puff to lay and pull my hair taut just so the sides of my head don't be bulky and just slide it to your desired position and remember to keep your thumb in front so you don't snag your hair out while you're tightening your puff. And once you get your puff where you want it to be, you're just going to tighten up and make a knot at the back and tuck everything in and next thing you're going to do of course is fluff with your hands and with your pick to give your hair some volume and this is the final look of my puff I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.